All right, so uh, online content creators, uh, it's like um, the cool thing now. We have a number of them in Ghana, and Nana Made in China is one of them. <laughs> uh, so we have him in the studio. Uh, we're going to find out what makes him tick, how he started, and maybe the challenges and growth that he's experienced. So Nana, mm. first of all, why did you choose that name, Nana Made in China? So apparently when I was in school, I, I, was, I was a bit of a funny actor because in class, Sebi Bisia, I actually like act and then like I take the whole class out of it. Like I always act. Mm -hmm. I it's not really really act like it's pretends to like mm -hmm. save myself or the class or the school out of something. So like it would always China, they would page me it's like make up when I was doing MC too. So when I host shows, I mentioned my name like I am Nana Made in this, Nana this, Nana this. And the last one is Nana Made in China. So when I say Nana Made in then the whole crowd says China. So like that was like the name that I felt like I should start using. So, so what kind of MC in what, what kind of events are you hosting now? So back then time? I was doing uh, school, different schools, um like outdooring, engagements, weddings, events, parties and all that. So yeah. you started quite early. Uh, yeah, whilst I was in school. What school is this? Hulutin to Cathedral Senior High School. Last time you said now you were mocking it, so I'm No, school, they you? were mocking my school. <laughs> 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 but how was school like for you? What did you study? Uh, yeah, well, I did general arts, yeah. history, um, economics, and general arts. Mm, was okay. Good, good, good. And in terms of the uh, content creation, when, when did it yeah. start? How did it start for you? So, whilst I was in school, I was like a Facebook video creator, like on Facebook. Mm -hmm. So, I was creating Facebook videos, like funny ones, things that are trendy and all that. And then in class, I, I would bring somebody in class and like talk about the person, teachers and stuff to my students, like mm -hmm. my class. And then as time went on, different class were coming to my class just to come and listen to what's going on in the school. Mm -hmm. and so when I was doing that and I, now I brought people on for interviews in class. So it was like a whole mm -hmm. the different thing in the whole class. So when I got out of school, I was, I was doing like um, a microfinance. I was selling, I was doing like trade. But what I was selling, no, not in Saddam Court. What are you selling? Bracelets, customized bracelets. Mm -hmm. So at a point, I started using my videos to sell the customized bracelets. Mm -hmm. And then when I started using my videos, no, not air selling. Mm -hmm. So I started doing it more. Because, like, when, when I used to do the delivery myself, see, me delivery now, almost share me and me video now, like they are happy. Mm -hmm. and then they mm -hmm. buy the stuff too. So I was getting fame and then getting money. So I was happy. So I was just doing that and then. It went on, I met my friends, they are called Scado TV. Mm -hmm. Then they produced my first show and then here we are. So the first show on Scado TV was called what? It was called Here from China, the, the show Okay. Itself, so, uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, so at what point did you now decide to go back to being independent and doing it yourself? So whilst we were doing Here from China with um, Scado TV, we actually wanted to, I actually wanted to do my own thing myself mm -hmm. because Man, I wanted to come. produce, oh, not really saying Tokwa. Yeah. like fight but then we are cool mm -hmm. so i wanted to produce my own self so i st before that i actually got a new management from mm -hmm. nice one entertainment who has been very helpful and then he was helping me with management with camera and production and all that then because i still wanted to be on my own and produce on myself i told him to and then now i am doing it on my own like directing production everything by myself so you have your own equipment and no not yet but i have some of the equipment but then i i'm i'm trying to get all my equipment myself to like start myself great so take us through uh the creation process for you when you are putting up about to put something out what do you go through what is the process like so i don't only do here from china mm -hmm. i do other content like my I'm a China. The one you posted. Mm -hmm, you remember mm -hmm. that one? I think, uh, yeah, one. yeah, yeah. Yeah. So the creation is, is it's it's okay. I just have to like, you know, get the news. If there's any verification I have to do, I verify if there's more so But you're doing comedy, so we don't need to verify anything. People will laugh anyway, whether it's true or not. Uh, but I mean bullet sealed me so now. <laughs> <laughs> I have to, I have to get it mm -hmm, mm -hmm. across and the bank or S A B R. Any old come and want some bonnet trend or for now, you are defaming my brand mm -hmm. because bullets came at me because I said something that wasn't true, which mm -hmm. is true. And Zandi Camel also talking about some things. I mean, like a Nyoma, like now, I think that it was a mission Nyoma maker because now, oh, just, oh, just say maybe they were a bit canon because um. 
when you are creating comedy, when you're doing parody, news parody, and people are aware of it, chances of them misunderstanding and wanting to see you are very minimal. Mm -hmm. But maybe they were over, you know, it's in a I remember I didn't say I was going to cry because yeah. yeah apart from I feel that. like I'm powerful mm -hmm. now because at first not any other thing I've seen me because I've mm -hmm. said things that are worse than what I just said. Mm -hmm. But then I feel like you see I know because I'm on a Doom TV, mm -hmm. I'm getting um, the mass numbers watching me. It was say because there are numbers watching you. You know, there's some power in what you're doing. The views. What somebody would think about you talking about somebody like Deborah is very important. Mm -hmm. In Tina, it was a mission. In Tina, I think say they are doing that. Cool. Uh, and see, how does it work now? It first goes on a drone before you own it, or no? I mean, I still own the content. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, it's online news. In Tina, sometimes I post first. Sometimes, mm -hmm. so if my editing goes late it has to go to adult tv first because uh, within the week mm -hmm. but more than more times i post it first on chinese avenue on youtube and then it goes on adult tv during the weekdays for the local environment also enjoy. so um on adult is it a, a, one day a week i have or? two days now oh cool so it's 15 minutes of greatness on tuesdays at 11 45 and then on wednesdays at 10 o'clock so only 15 minutes now we create a content and some people are following now and every sometimes they're looking forward to the next thing do you see ghana the space as um in msc uh Maunya content to work around often and as uh, tabia it's quite dry and mm. it's difficult to create yeah content. sometimes it's very very dry sometimes but then i feel like because of how i've got to i don't really have to wait for the news to happen mm -hmm. i just have to not manipulate mm -hmm. but then so most of it are not I don't really do entertainment news mm -hmm. I actually do things like you know medical using all his girlfriends for music music in your man so yeah so like those things that in Kofa doing so down then I take people's mind there because sometimes the news get dry. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And uh you mentioned an example of some of the issues you've had. Uh uh, what are some other challenges that you've had? Uh, whether your daily uh, movement to get a content or even after our creative content, how feedback, backlash comes in? Mm, what are some so of those sometimes I, the challenges that I face are like maybe like on set, mm -hmm. maybe on set, because sometimes I just have a hard time to do my I don't choose in the studio mm -hmm. or at a particular place let's say in the market, at the store, like different places around Ghana. Mm -hmm. So maybe I'll be a corner and call and ask my before, then the noise, I can't mm -hmm. really shoot. Mm -hmm. Then sometimes to when it's when the video comes out, the comments, I don't think those are challenges, but I think like those are things that ACC. Mm -hmm. The comments, the negative ones, the positive ones and all that. And then the people that I am talking about, because mm -hmm. you'll be on a or freely okay, so mm -hmm. they kind of sell exactly. Mm -hmm. But then I have to, because you put yourself out there, so mm -hmm. it is what you think you want people to see you for. <laughs> now, what could be my thing? I regretted that, or have you put some content out there that went so wrong, and then as a person you felt um, and time you see, and time you see because that's what I did. That's what I did. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do anything to put somebody in a negative space, mm -hmm. no. It's it's all for you know to inform, to entertain, to educate, and all that. But if I'm going on my one, then you not a because I don't think my news are negative mm -hmm, or mm -hmm. it creates something negative about somebody. Mm -hmm. No. Well, what if you're more mere content, yes, sometimes, especially with what you're doing, sometimes speaking on the news of the day and making spoof out of it, you know. Uh, who are some of the subjects that it always work for you? What come as some uh, it travels far, you get all the views or the comments. Who are some I think your, your easy best, targets? Your, your best friend is part. Who is best, that? Chatawali is your best friend. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Oh, he is. Uh, uh, he isn't? He is. Actually, he's my cousin. Oh, for real? <laughs> <laughs> so, Chatawali, you know, um, Wendy Shea, mm -hmm. um, Wankra. Katawale, Wendy Shea, Moesha Budon, Fela Makafui, Efia Odos, Tadebura, Medical, Kufi Kinata, mm -hmm. the musicians, the actors, mm -hmm. yes, it does well. Just uh, social media um, influences in Abiyan, it doesn't go well, far. Fair. But the musicians and the... Um, I'm one more for you. Efia Shwa's nigga them. They can be videos. 
Na ka de bi ya ti wa ma bi. Se me ya invite me na me so me time pitch ching ga. Na me ke kiss in cra. Me ko hono no me ko ye djuma. I have worked there before. Oh as what? As a waiter. Oh, oh, yeah, for, oh. The, for their food and beverages. You just products. tried it out of the blender. It's something you have done. No, that's when I was very broke, so okay. I had to work out something. I had a, had a friend. His name is Albert. He used to work there, so mm -hmm. he linked me up, and then I also got the chance. But my new job more and check was not at an I was popular on social media. Mm -hmm. It's me call no more. The workers, hey China, I feel like hey, I'm mm -hmm. Then when I go and serve somebody, I know the guy on Instagram. Like mm -hmm. okay, now it's done. Then I had mm -hmm. to like put it all. And then like try sponsorships for mm -hmm. other brands and all that, and I think it's working now. So, um, Osha Bakad, was it how you expected it to be in terms of content creation, the way people are responding to it? Yeah, uh, apparently, for me, I thought I was going to be a YouTube sensation, an ACBR, a social media, like something. But already, I'm getting like local networks channeling mm -hmm. it, mm -hmm. and there's a, a channel in Kenya. Who also wants to like channel it and also give subtitles mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and there are people in saudi arabia who are always acting for content mm -hmm. even though like and call and i mean that time in creating a wow wow as they want but the way they are re requesting, requesting for it and i feel like yeah we are getting the i mean and yet what we want but then it's not where we used to be and uh, what have been some of your highlights so far when i started with Kado tv mm -hmm. nana magwan came to like it and she commented mm -hmm. and then I think Efia saw me through my show, and then the first day I met on my ground, she screamed. I'm like, I'm supposed to be screaming, like, girl, mm -hmm. easy. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, I think, and then when I go out in the markets, what the people do is amazing. It's like, it touches my heart. Like, mm -hmm. I don't feel like, like, even coming here, like, in Kofo, hey, you, like, it's mm -hmm. very, very heartwarming. And then mm -hmm. there was one time somebody told me that, mommy, ew, like, that same day. She was on Instagram, saw my video, mm -hmm. and like, she doesn't know, but she was able to bust out into later. And then this morning, somebody was rolling on the floor in their office. I feel like mm -hmm. that is like an award for me. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I've been awarded for um, Best Tashari Show by um, Tashari Show, uh, Tashari, UMB, mm -hmm. Ghana Tashari Awards. Mm -hmm. I was nominated for Ghana Movie Awards this season for mm -hmm. Best Social Media Influencer. Mm -hmm. And I also won Most Creative Influencer on OKFM. Okay. Okay. So I think it has been amazing, an amazing time for me. Cool. Yeah. Those are the untouchable <laughs> rewards. Let's talk about the ones that you can count and put in your wallet. I uh, mean, <laughs> to have your show syndicated on Adam, that's yeah. that's good money. Um, apparently, I I didn't take my show to Adam TV to pay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Adam TV called me because mm -hmm. they think the content was good and it's going to catch a very great local market mm -hmm. for them as well. That's what I'm saying. It gives you power. So you, you, I mean, how yeah. much did you charge them? I didn't charge them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they have a contract that is going okay. to be based on like sponsorship. If I mm -hmm. have, if they have, mm -hmm. they will opposite in the show because it's great content for mm -hmm. people. So I have a leverage to get sponsorship for myself. Mm -hmm. And I'm also a brand ambassador for other products like mm -hmm. Panamaya Cosmetics, Bass Africa, on social media that mm -hmm. I do like random relative videos, crawlers, and then add-ons on my videos for them. And you're getting a lot of those, so... so can I mean, and yeah, a lot of dough, but then, I mean, uh, yeah, like a boy, mm -hmm, so what's mm -hmm, that? Mm -hmm. production, I mean, you know production. Mm -hmm, and mm -hmm, what kind mm -hmm. of man, be we all for chops. So. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. It's, um, in the future, what would you... First of all, uh, do you look up to people, people within the same space? It will be or have or motivate you to do this. Do you have someone? Yeah, say? I have a lot of people. I think um, growing up, I have been watching um, Ellen the Generous, mm -hmm. Steve Harvey, mm -hmm. Delay, mm -hmm. Zion Felix, um, this guy, I forget his name, Amaya Debra. You know? <laughs> um, Where is he? I don't know. Like, <laughs> <laughs> because, you know, like you see these people, Samini. Mm -hmm. Like it's it's amazing to see you be a wait my age man for a very long time. Mm -hmm. It's attractive to me. So me who I beg you some time like why you read you for almost ten years. Like I am a fit. Mm -hmm. Like you, maybe I also know come about your YouTube videos mm -hmm. that I've mm -hmm. seen for like thirteen years. Mm -hmm. Like it's very inspirational. So people like you, you support like you you inspire us, I mm -hmm. mean, I beg who them. They are all what I look up to like mm -hmm. to be like to be in the industry for fifty years and over. Right. And to, oh, in, let's say the next five years, what would you want to achieve? In the next five years, dear, now we'll say Chinese Avenue, like it's an established 
media house uh, mm -hmm. like we have our radio we have our tv we have other videos we have other presenters who are also working for me mm -hmm. I, i'm not going to be the presenter always it was so be sunya in me you know mm -hmm. for maybe international news music videos like now you know beyond sunya space under me maybe an acting guild something that you know i mean god day with day so great so uh, it's been amazing talking to you it's been amazing and um, you've been watching from afar and uh we, we we see what you're doing we can thank only you. encourage you to do it uh, so do it well and take it to the next step all right guys it's a wrap <laughs>